Hello everybody, how's it going? Welcome to another episode of the HSS Corona. We are playing Space Haven, guys, and uh, we have a lot of stuff to do. I have some plans with you today. Now, the first things that I want to mention is we still have a derelict here that still needs some, um, you know, some salvage. Or we need to salvage from it. And uh, that will take some time. And in the meantime, we're gonna fix our ship a little bit. I, I just realized, thank you for the comment, by the way, that I was missing a wall here. So what we're gonna be doing is the following. We're gonna move the cryo chambers around a bit so that we can build a wall. Let's go ahead and build a wall. Alright, gonna finish that. And at some point we also need to build another yeah, another cryopod here because now we have seven people. But I want more. I definitely want more. So we have two more uh, slots here, two more spots for the cryo chambers. We can have eight in total in this room. That's, that's, that's okay. Another thing that I wanna try is the following. We have a gas scrubber here and that thing should be able to get the raw chemicals out of the air and, and bind it. Um, you know, the chemicals that are uh, produced while we are producing wares here. Uh, like they are just uh, noxious gases that are uh, being emitted. And for that, I have the feeling this thing is not working efficiently enough. I had uh, one playthrough before I started recording because I just wanted to get into it where like the whole room was filled with green gas and I don't know why. So I think... I'm going to build uh, a wall heater here, a thermal re regulator, because I have the feeling that we might get more done when we heat up the room. I don't know. Maybe we also need an atmosphere here. Maybe we need oxygen here to actually build these gases. But um, I don't think that we have enough resources for an oxygen generator now. No, we don't. Oh, wait. We can use a... We can build a tag block. Can we build a tag block? Uh, we are missing uh, blue chips. Okay. Yeah, we are not building that yet. Okay, but maybe the wall heater is already doing something. And then there's one more thing that I want to do with you guys. Um, I am about to probably capture some prisoners. And for that, we need a prisoner's area. Alright? So what we're going to be doing is I want to build them uh, or build the area behind the med bay. And um, I have an idea how I want to build that. So we're going to build it like... Maybe like this. That should be good enough. So my, my prisoners should have it somewhat comfortable because if they have a comfortable life on my ship, we can recruit them as regular crew members later. And that's the thing that I want to try. So let's build something here and have a good time trying this out. So that's gonna be a door. Here we go. For all of you who are worried that I have now a breach in my ship, I don't. So that would be hilarious. If you're building something on your ship and then all of a sudden, boom, breach. No, it's not, it's not a case. It's not that you need to um, need to do anything about it here. Uh, did I screw it up? No. That's the area that I wanted. Ah, I did screw it up a bit. Um, hmm. Oh, you know what? Uh, we're gonna make this the toilet area. We need, like, wait, this and this and one more row. Uh, exactly. Okay, here we go. So, with that being said, we can already, yeah, 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 uh, we can already build some stuff here. Let's go ahead and uh, build. Now, what we need is uh, a kitchen. We definitely need a kitchen for that, so that the people are feeling comfortable. Uh, where would we put that? Uh, first of all, the toilet goes here, right? Yeah. And then we're gonna build a wall around it as well, so that they have some privacy. Man, I'm treating these uh, soon-to-be prisoners pretty well here. And then we need, like, the regular stuff that you would need in the crew quarters. You need something for the people to eat. And you need beds. The kitchen could go here. Sure, let's build that. Uh, we need a place to sit and a place, place to sleep. And I'm thinking... Do I take bunk beds? It only gives you comfort 5. This gives you comfort 10. These beds are just way better. God, the prisoners are getting better sleeping chambers than our regular... Crew members? Sounds so wrong. It sounds so wrong. Uh, how do we use this efficiently? As efficiently as possible. That seems good to me. Mm-hmm. We can't oh we can we can do it like like this, but ooh, that, that looks bad. We also need a table. I really want to give him a couch. I don't know. I feel like it. Okay. The more comfortable they have it, the better it is for them. 
the the more likely it is that we're gonna convert them. Why is the wall? Oh, the wall is not built yet. There we go. I'm still figuring out, I'm trying to figure out where, where should I seat them. Maybe it's just bunk beds, and we never have to care about this anymore. Okay. So, that's... Uh-oh. Uh-oh, we are being shot. Oh my god. Um, um... Why? Oh god. It would be so good if there was a bigger message, like a red flashing alert whenever you are getting hit or something. Like, like the, the, the border, like the edge of the screen flashing up or something. Holy crap, guys, we are getting shot. Um, okay, Jebediah is on the shield console. That's the good news. Let's go ahead and man the battle stations. Can we defend ourselves? Turret's online. Alright, so we're gonna take turret number one, turret number two. And we're gonna shoot back. Uh, okay, wit's end. Let's go. Fight me, bro. Oh my god. Luckily, their shields are pretty low and they, uh, we are doing twice as much damage as they do. So, we should win the DPS race. Right? Oh my god. Yeah, we are dealing structural damage to their hull now. Also, only dealing one damage. I wonder where this is going, like with different weapon upgrades and so on. Keep in mind, guys, this is early access. This game is not out yet, and it's still in production and still in development. And so far, we are kind of wrecking these guys. Come on! Give them hell! Boom! Ship destroyed! <gasps> okay! Okay, 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 that looks good. Holy hell. Alright, we got the pirates down. Here's the thing, their ship is now not able to jump away anymore. Wonderful job, everybody. Good fight, Kara. Nice job on the turrets there. So, you're gonna dump some more energy in our shields. Wow. Oh, I'm happy. I'm so happy. But yeah, uh, the crew is still alive. We just disabled their ship. And we can now try to board it. The ship, that is. And... Um, how to say it? Overwhelm the enemies with full force. I don't think that we have the force because they are probably more than us and they have probably a lot of guns there. And we only have one shotgun and three pistols. And another thing that I can do is I'm just gonna wait and do nothing. And then they will die because their, their life critical systems are failed now. They have no energy anymore. And, and the ship is done, I believe. Which means they are running around in their ship with just their spacesuits on and eventually they will run out of air and then they will die and then only I get in there and, um, you know, try to, try to get what's left over. And then I can take their guns. Um, they probably run lots of shotguns, um, assault rifles and so on. And as soon as we have our crew equipped, the next pirate ship is gonna be the pirate ship where we're gonna try to take prisoners. Okay? So that's the idea here. Cool! That's the first fight. Um, but yeah, uh, let's build here. Let's keep building, guys. We need a wall light. Let's build a wall light. Like, like. Right here. Alright, guys, I'm being very generous. You are granted light in your, in your new house. And we need somewhere... Something where the people can sit. I will block the path to the bed if I do it like this, right? I really want a confined space. I don't want them to be so lux luxurious here. Okay, that is gonna be enough. And if I put the table here... Okay, that works. And then I can put another chair here. Okay. So they have the absolute minimum, <laughs> except for a toilet that doesn't function because it's not on the power grid. <laughs> now let's put that on the power grid then. What about the wall node? Um, I don't really want to put the wall power node into the room. I'd rather have it outside of the room. Just in case, you know, not they are, that they are doing something bad to us. Okay, let's build it here. Could have put a floor node on the on the floor. Uh, but wall node is fine. Wall node is absolutely fine. All right. So this is stocked up. Oh, uh, another thing that we need to do. We need to, of course, set this as the prison area now. All right, that's gonna be prison area. Very good. So they can use all of that if they are prisoners. Can only be used by prisoner. 
can only be used by prisoner and is not on the power grid. Okay. So, speaking of light, uh, you were also saying that I should put light everywhere, literally, because that'll lower the chance of accidents. And I think that's what I'm gonna do now. So let's, uh, let's talk about light. Let's go. That's furniture. Man, I really like these wall lights. Okay, let's put some light here. Let's put some light uh, here. I think this is the, the area here is not on the grid. Not really. Okay. This is the light offense. Uh, this is one here already. Put one next to the heater. Let's put one into our cryo chambers as well. Okay. Make it nice and cozy. A light here. And in our generator room. Why not? Oh, I wanted to build a door here. Like, I wanted to replace, yeah, re relocate the door, definitely. Because, um, there has to be like a very long corridor to our, to our main generator, don't you think? Let's go ahead and put that here for the moment. And then we're gonna put the door over here as soon as they are done with the, with the wall readjustment. There we go. Move the door or the wall here. Yeah. Oh, I like it. It's looking way better now. I mean, obviously, we have the we have a little bit of a problem. Our comfort is now really spilling over into this area completely. So, what's your problem here? You have no light in this room? Okay, you're gonna get a light then. Have a light, buddies. Okay. There's no light on the other side. There's no light nowhere. Actually, the light is really helping out. Seemingly. That's really good. So, did you build a wall finally? You did not build the wall. Where is my freaking wall? Seriously, guys. Where is my wall? What? There's an issue. There's a wall building issue. There we go. Okay, so finally we have our wall back. <laughs> um, I don't know if it's time already. Shall we go in? Shall we, shall we try to, uh, to board this? I have the feeling that we can try to do that. So, Alan, Holden, Peter. I want you... Oh, to enter the craft now. I need the craft. Where's the craft? Where's my spacecraft? There we go. I need to draft it. Uh, please move. Uh, can I? Can I not bring that back, that thing? Oh, it's coming already. Alright. So, Ellen, Holden, Peter. Get the hell in there! And... Yeah, the shuttle is gonna go over here now. Where would we dock? We can, of course, dock on the... Um, on, on, the, on the airlock, but you know what? I'm gonna dock here on the bridge. See where this is going. It's some unreachable areas. Ah, uh, okay, I, I need to fix that soon. Maybe we just build... yeah. Just a chair. That's good. I mean, so far we don't have any prisoners. So, that's okay. So, and we definitely go very, very slowly here. Because if there are too many people, I'm just gonna retreat from that. Here we go, guys. Here we go. Docking procedure completed. Are we not completed? We are completed. But I cannot bring my people out of here. Okay, again, uh, I'm gonna dock here, except. Let's see if that works. Here we go. Okay, so I got my three people. Oh my god. I am, I am mildly scared. Hello? Are there pirates in here? Let's go down here first. Let's be careful. It is quiet. Too quiet. Hello, pirates! Are you dead? They say you are dead. Seriously, where are they? There's nobody here! Uh, I will check this out later, guys. Uh... Where? What? Ghost ship! How? Oh no! Oh, there they are! No, 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 that's them! Yeah, look at that. Uh, 
Pick that up. Ship, ship explored. The wits end. Okay, so we got the ship. Yeah, this is where the enemies died. Right? There is a... I mean, that's Holden or, or, or Peter or what, whatever. Yeah, it's Peter. But there's a pistol on the ground. That means that there were people here. Okay. Okay, that means that if I go transfer now, you can see we got five shotguns, two assault rifles, bunch of guns. It's like everybody will have a gun and then there are five dead bodies that we're gonna leave here. Apart from it, that's pretty good salvage, I would say. So we're gonna take everything but the corpses and then we're gonna... We're gonna start stripping the ship down as well. Seems like a plan to me. Cool, you guys, you can go home. Ship can also go home. And uh, we got our first pirate ship. And then I would say, after we got everything here, we're gonna take... We're gonna take a bit of time to arm our people, right? We got so many guns now, like lots of shotguns, lots of assault rifles, and uh, that's gonna be very helpful for the next crew that we're gonna encounter. All right, very good. You still have no power. Why don't you have power? That thing not being built. Oh, we need to... I see, I see, I see. We need more energy blocks. Can we build energy blocks? We can build energy blocks. Okay, cool. Uh, and then I have to do something about the sofa. Uh, you know what? That's the, that's the visitor area for the med bay now. You can sit here. And, and, you know, hold the hands of your beloved ones that are actually getting getting better in the beds. That seems good. Okay. Wait, can I even... Give me a second. There was an unreachable area there. Let's build a stool. Let's see. Oops, the chair. That should be it now. Yeah, with that, we shouldn't have any unreachable areas. Is this done? No, it's not yet. So yeah, so that's the prisoner's area. Um, we have the power grid, and now we have the toilet online as well. Alright, so that was really good. That was absolutely incredible. Uh, by the way, isn't there a ship coming? Wasn't there something about a ship? Oh no, it was just the ship explored not notification. That was that. Alright, we still have stuff to transfer here. You see, the thing is, with a second shuttle bay, we could have we could have been so much faster. But it also takes so much stuff. So as soon as we find a trader that gives us tech blocks, I'm gonna buy all of them and I'm gonna give him all of my scrap because my 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 um my hangar, my storage is is full. It's so full already. Let's check out what we have. Oh, there are so many resources, so many base materials that we need to actually uh, produce somehow. Yeah. It's definitely a thing. This is the refinery for energy cells. How many do we have? Three. Okay, we have three at any point because we have set a, yeah, a minimum for that. That's good. This is an ongoing task. This is also an ongoing task if we have less than 10. Man, I want to do so many things at the same time. We definitely don't need more base materials. We should not mine anymore. Because we have limited storage. Our storage is 94 out of 250. The other one is basically full. Let me see. Do we have the guns already? We don't have the guns already. But yeah, this is what we are just doing. We are just waiting a while. Hmm. I wonder if my... If I get prisoners, uh, if they are gonna be comfortable here. If they only have, like... If I have four prisoners at any time, only two of them can sit. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah, we will see about that. What about the comfort in general? I mean... The temperature is a little bit low in the cryo chambers. Are you working now? Yeah, you're not getting any better. Oh, by the way, I wanted to crank that up to like 30 degree. Like, make it really hot down here. People are wearing spacesuits anyway. Let's see if uh, heating this up gives us more gases that will be emitted. Oh yeah. Oh, that's nice. Nice and warm. Here we go. So we have the cold area and the warm area. <laughs> Very good. So we gotta see if this is doing something. 
It's currently at 0.2, that is the, the chemical gases that are the raw chemicals that we are getting out of there. And I really hope it's getting better. It's a pretty cool ship. I mean, look at the uh, the layout here. They have the generator. They have a pretty big generator over here. Um, this is the docking bay. This is where the shuttle was, I believe. Yeah, pretty much. And the sleeping area. The command area. It's also pretty cool that they have um, like that big command table. Yeah, there are so many different ways to build your ships. Uh, speaking of... There's a ship about to enter. No, it entered here. Let's try to trade. These are super blocks. Hmm. Okay. They are paying good price for advanced materials. Yeah, noble materials and carbon. We have a bunch of excess noble materials, I gotta say. Uh, is there anything else that we want? Seriously. We got 12 infra blocks, so we don't necessarily need them. And we got a lot of infra scraps. We can always build infra blocks. That's easy. We can just recycle them. No problem. Soft blocks. We can also just recycle. Hmm. Medical supplies. Plastics. Should I buy plastics? I've never seen plastics before. I don't know if there's even a thing that needs plastics currently. Maybe? Maybe just buying them now? Hmm. We have money, that's the thing. Oh, there's the gun. Very good. So we can already uh, think about uh, equipping people. You know what? I'm gonna... I'm gonna get all of his uh, credits, or a bunch of his credits, and I will buy... I will buy a bit of plastic from him. Actually, three units of plastic for, let's say, five units of my, of my materials. That seems good. Okay, so we have plastic now. Very, very good. Okay, so Ellen is currently running a shotgun. Holden is running this kind of holdout blaster. And Peter as well. And they're currently busy stripping the stuff here, right? There's Holden, there's Peter, this is Jebediah, yeah. So I need to I need to really think about who is gonna be another person that wants to fight. So let's take a look at skills. Jean-Luc is actually pretty good with accuracy. Wow. Alright. Holden, not so much? Oh, he's wearing a space suit? That's why. His base is 50. His perception is 12. Yeah, by just wearing a space suit, he is not that accurate anymore. That's interesting to know. Oh, and Jean-Luc is also wearing a space suit now. What about Jebediah? Jebediah's base is... It's pretty good, honestly. All of these people are okay. So it doesn't really matter who I put there, except for Kaylee. Kaylee is really bad, so Kaylee is not gonna do anything. But everybody else seems to be decent, having a base of 50% and then perception 15. Peter. Oh no. Oh, oh no. Wait. Oh, one second. Uh, things happen here. Holy crap. Okay, I need to do something now. Okay, um, Ellen, Holden, get off the ship. Um, what? What, 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 what? Okay, I want Ellen. That's Ellen. Okay, you gotta go ahead and... Ellen, go ahead. Pick up Peter. Uh, Kara is also still here. You're gonna pick up... Uh, Jebediah. Uh-oh. Uh oh, not good. Okay, Ellen. Enter ship. Uh, enter ship. Ooh, that was close. That was very close. What about Peter? He's unconscious. Um, we, ha we have a problem. Okay, so I need to... Give me a second. Jebediah, please enter ship. Can you do that for me? Enter the ship. Kara, you're fine? Ish. No, she's not. Um, One second, one second, one second. Ellen is fine. So Ellen is gonna get off the ship. No, no, no! No! 
Shuttle, stay here. I want you to dock. This is some, some, yeah, it's a little bit weird here. Oh, wait, Kara can get oxygen down here. Good, nice. Um, okay, so if I bring the shuttle back now, the people should be able to get home. Oh, man. I need a second shuttle because I don't want these incidents to happen anymore. So the people are there. Please get Kara back. Ooh, that was close. We almost lost two people. <laughs> they were uh, unconscious. They were out of oxygen. Wow. Kara is always getting stuff back. Yeah, sure. Well, I have no idea how that happened, but they were just... They were just overextending, seemingly. And this storage is now full. The other one... Yeah. But since John luc is here already, let's go ahead and draft you real quick. And pick some weapons up. Okay, John luc Shotgun. Nah, he's gonna get the... The assault rifle, absolutely. The assault rifle has a fast firing rate, but only shoots a bullet in a single spot. The, the shotgun shoots three bullets at the same time. And that is the difference. Okay, Jean-Luc has a weapon. Holden is currently sleeping. Kaylee is the only one that I don't want to shoot. But I'm gonna give her a pistol or something anyway. Okay, as soon as Holden is done with his breakfast, I'm gonna send him over here to get a better gun. Let me see... Yeah, 62 is fine. Okay. Alright, Holden. Uh, draft you. Go here. Pick it up. Nice. Holden is getting a shotgun. Perfect. John Luke has one. Alan has a shotgun as well. So Jebediah is somewhere in a spacesuit on some ship. That's okay. Peter! Go here, man. Draft. Pick this up! I want you to take the shotgun as well. And as soon as the next pirates are coming, I, I will have a good time. Oh boy. Okay, he's also fine. So then we have Kaylee on the ship, Kara's on the ship. Jebediah is here now. Alright, Jebediah. I heard you are really good with gunnery. Take that gun. Why is he so wide? Is he a synth? Uh, I'm a bit afraid now. <gasps> I cannot do that, Dave. <laughs> Holy crap. Uh, this is still not moving anywhere. Yeah, maybe we need an like like an like an atmosphere here, or maybe it's just very very slow. I think an oxygen generator wouldn't be so bad here. Cool. How far are you stripping that thing down? Oh, pretty far. All right, that's good. I mean, do I need all of the stuff here? I don't think I need it. So we're gonna stop salvaging and we're just gonna transfer the rest of the stuff back to our ship. The second hangar, I gotta get it. You know what? Maybe we're gonna make a like a full redesign of the ship. Um, I was thinking about building a hangar up on the front, like like transferring all of this stuff all the way to the front, having our um, our command station in the center, making a nice room out of it, with uh, you know a big table and everything, and then different consoles and different ends of the room, but in the center of it, not necessarily on the front, because. Who is flying on vision in space anyway, right? And yeah, this is gonna be like a big platform anyway. So might as well have the command center all the way in the center. And then the front is gonna be like our docking station. And... I don't know, maybe, maybe we have a good time. Or I relocate the whole industrial area into the front and then extend this area. That makes more sense, I think. Yeah, it's, it's less relocating. Yeah, that's okay. Also, we have monster meat here. Monster corpse. Hmm. It's getting fuller and fuller. How much do we get from here? Let me see. Okay, give me a second. Select all, except for this, 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 and this. And then we're gonna transfer everything. There's still some water and some energy and some food on this. So let's get it, and then we're gonna get the hell out of here. Ooh, alright. I'm really hoping that I find more pirates, because the first fight was absolutely glorious. Oh, by the way, um, since Kara and Kaylee are here... Kaylee, give me a second. I want you to pick up a gun. We have so many shotguns, so Kaylee is gonna get a shotgun, and Kara is also gonna get a shotgun. And then I think everybody has a, a proper weapon, so it seems, right? You're fine. Dup, dup, dup. Dip, 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 dip. Perfect. 
Everybody is armed to the teeth. Ah, let's go. Oh my god, we're gonna we're gonna get these guys down. So, what now? What's next? We're gonna wait on the until this is stripped, and then we will move to the next planet. And that thing has a good uh, a good amount of mining opportunities. We have nine hull blocks. I can already extend my ship a bit. The problem is the weight. The more stuff we are gathering here, the heavier our ship becomes. And that means we need another hyperdrive also pretty, pretty soon. Our bottleneck, of course, is always, always tech blocks. We need to get them somehow. We can build tech blocks. But we need the blue chips, the blue optronics components. In order to get them, we need to... Uh, what do we need to build? Again, let me see. Resource. It was something like the electronic fabricator? Ah, it's that. The optronics fabricator. We need three tech blocks to get that, and then one energy block. Okay. Yeah, I think we can get there. Also, why is this not powered? Ah, that's the, the light. The light, the light, the light. Uh, let me go ahead and... Actually, if we just relocate that... Oh, I, I just took the one spot that is not on the grid. Nah, that's fine. Just move it, like, over here to the other side, and you should be fine. Okay, so that's fine. That's the only one we have, the only problem. Yeah, we are, we are just missing components left and right. But the good news is that we will be able to salvage some more, gather some more of these uh, raw chemicals from the next planet that we go to. So maybe we can set up something. And by the way, the 5-7, the we're just gonna sell all of them as soon as we find the, the next trader. That's gonna be it. Okay, guys, are you done? Not quite. So here's the thing. Uh, I'm gonna leave all of the scraps because we have so many of them. We have 37 infra scraps. We can at any point get more. It's more important to move now, I think. Yeah, very good. Very, very good. But I want the other thing, uh, the other things there. So what's the next priority? Let me think about it. It could be another shuttle bay. And the shuttle bay will help us with um, salvaging faster, gathering resources faster. Um, that will accelerate the gameplay in a way where we don't have to stay in one spot so long anymore and we can roam around the map a bit quicker. Building the Optronics factory will help us being a little bit self-sufficient, being able to build tech blocks more reliably. And that means we can expand our ship quicker. Hmm... Was there a power spike? It was a power spike. Yeah, I think there was a power spike. I also have the feeling that relocating the batteries is also a good idea. Just spreading them out a bit so that they are closer to um, like the, 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 crucial, the crucial spots and they can deliver their power there a little bit quicker. I think distance actually matters here. Insufficient oxygen levels. On who? On Holden, because he's working too long in, in, in zero atmosphere. Ah, oh, that's okay. Yeah, I think I should also test that a bit. We can actually do it now. Hmm, should we? Should we do that? I think the answer might be yes. Okay, I, I want to try this. So, let's get out of here. We take, I'd say, this battery here. Give me a second. I need to cut the link here. And you're gonna establish the link... There. Cool. So this battery is now off the grid. That means we can relocate it. Come on. Move. Hmm. But where to? It only takes up one spot. That's good. Um, sure, let's just bring it all the way down here. Why not? Seems good to me. Here we go. Putting it down here, and now we should not really have any energy problems down here anymore, because now we have a power storage that's very close to the solar refinery section. 
And we only need to put it on the grid. There we go. Good. Batteries on the grid. It's also being charged up. And yeah, this is hopefully fine. It also has a direct um, direct energy um, splash towards these two factories now. Okay, you're done? Oh, there's another ship. Oh, please have something good. Come on. Energy cells. Hmm. I like the idea of having a surplus of energy cells. Because we need energy cells to fuel our shield battery and our turrets. I like to buy them. They want fruit. And we have a lot of fruit. Yeah, you know what? I'll take all of your energy cells. Give me 10. Thank you. And you're gonna get... Oh yeah, you're gonna get so much vegetables here. Cool. That's a fair trade. I like. Anything else that I want? Fuel, maybe? Maybe just some credits. I think I like the credits. Oh, and I wanted to, to sell the pistols. So, he have some pistols. You can have all of them. I'm gonna take your credits for it. Alrighty. So, we got two trays, which means that our shuttle needs to travel twice towards the ship. And... We are basically done here. Good. So after the trade, we can actually jump to the next star sector. Very, very good. Try to build an operations console. Oh yeah, that's a thing that we can also think about. Getting that operations console online so we can actually talk to the people. And um, maybe a scanner. Building a scanner is cool. So I can actually scan the, uh, the enemy ships and see what they actually have in there. And, and prepare a bit better for boarding the ships later on. But it's not high priority. It's not that we need it necessarily. It would be nice to have. Okay, are you done with the trade? First trade is done. Okay, what about second trade? Alright, guys. We can actually start preparing the next jump. Let's prepare and then we're gonna go down there. Uh, yeah, we are still missing the craft, but that's fine. It's already coming back. By the time it's back, we have prepared to jump, and then we can jump. Ooh. We have discovered a lot already. Ooh, we should probably go back here. Yeah, we have no green crystals. I mean, we're gonna get some here. We can also just take them and then go to the next, uh, to the next system, doing a big hyper jump. I think that's viable. We don't need to go back. It's fine. We just take the necessary resources and just go then. That's a derelict. We should stay very close to the derelict so that we can uh, salvage that. It's always taking longer than the mining. Good, good, good. Yeah, seems good. Uh, I will take carbon. Do we need carbon? I kind of think we do. We'll take everything. We also take all the Hyperium, and of course the raw chemicals. So, our parts are gonna be busy. That's the good news. But I also need an attack squad to actually check out the ship. Can actually send... Kaylee is not good. I was thinking about Jean-Luc, Kara and Kaylee. But I'm gonna wait for my, for my regular squad, for Holden, Ellen and then Peter. These guys have proven well. Okay, Ellen... Holden... Peter. I can even take Jebediah with me. Okay, let's do that, guys. We're gonna go in with four people. Zip. And then we're gonna... Dock. Here. Hell yeah. Let's do it. Very, very good. We're gonna disembark and have a good time on the ship. Hopefully. Oh my god! No! Why? Retreat! Retreat! Shoot them! Or, I don't know, defend yourselves. <laughs> Alright. We aced it. So far. There's so many of them! Uh, can I, can I shoot this? I mean, that's the good news. We got weapons and we got a hell of a lot of them. Wow. There's a huge infestation. I need this operation console to scan before we go in. Uh, shoot this. <laughs> I mean, the shotguns are coming in big time. And I'm very happy that I'm going in with four people. Because these shotgun blasts are devastating. 
Hit him. Nice. Very good. Are we done? We are done. The 1313. The ACS 1313. Whatever that name is. It's a small ship. So we won't get much out of it. But I think this is okay. I don't need to draft you anymore. Good. So, now what did we get? Oh, a bunch of tech blocks. Yeah, I like that. We are leaving these monster corpses behind, I think. Alien corpses. Lots of energy. Wow. That's actually quite good. So we take this. And we have the people... Yeah, they have everything to do now. They have all hands full of tasks. Um, the, the shuttle is gonna shuttle between the derelict, the mining pods are mining. And I think this is gonna be good. Two tech... Uh, tech blocks. We have two tech blocks. I am very, very tempted to build the optronics thing here. Where are our... Uh, we don't have chemical resources. We needed that as well, the chemical refinery, in order to build the chemical resources out of our raw materials. We have some raw chemicals lying around. But it's not enough yet. 0 0.2 still. Hmm. We needed more attack blocks. I would say if we have 10 tech blocks, we can actually set up our full facility. So all we need is like 10 more tech blocks, or let's say 5 or so. Oh man, what's the current status here? It's 2. Okay. Insufficient resources. Wait a second, I'll check that out in a second. What do we have insufficient of? Tronics component? Yeah, that's right, uh, of course. We need more tech blocks. Somehow. Please. Give me that. Oh, by the way, did you see Jean-Luc was just taking a break here? Hmm. Maybe maybe a bench here. Like a sofa area here. That we can then put into um, a better spot later. Maybe that gives the people some comfort. Always good to have that. Uh, the wrong one. Couldn't build here. Because of that? Really? Oh, man. It would fit so nicely into this area. Seriously. But, I mean, we have a sofa here. The people can just, just do it like this. That's okay. That's all good. So, what we are waiting for is... Oh, we got everything already. Oh, great. We are just waiting for the salvage of the Hyperium. Should we salvage here? Give me some energy scrap. Yeah. So again, while the pods are mining, I want my shuttle to do some things as well. Oh wait, at the same time, the pod has to go and strip this component, right? I don't know. Mining five. Come on, guys. You need to drill harder. Faster, better, stronger. Okay. Ah, they are manually scrapping this. Okay, got it. Yeah, they're taking all the internals, all the internal components, and they're just dismantling. And then they're bringing it back to the shuttle. Perfect. Very, very good. So, let's take a look at our people again. Feeling a little hungry. Minor discomfort. Minor is okay. Also, there's a ship coming in. I think we have talked to them already. It's fine. I was hoping for some more pirates, honestly. Olden has shat his pants. Why? What's going on here? Do we need more toilets? Are you are you too many people now? We can build a second toilet here. Olden, what's going on, man? You took a poo in your pants. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that must feel uncomfortable. Uh, Alright, so here's what we do. We're gonna give the people another... Another toilet. Kind of makes sense to me. Let's move this whole wall situation around. I'm not gonna separate them from one another. Yeah, it's fine. We can actually leave this wall here. Okay, put another wall... ...here, and then... Oh my god, what did, what did I do? Oh, I blocked them off. Alright. That's not good. 
Hmm. I guess I have to move a battery. Let's move him down here. So far so good. There might be a little bit of a power shortage because of our, our network. Let's check that out. No, actually, it's fine. This is working. Our network is stable. Perfect. So then again, another wall here. And then we're going to put the second shit block here. Uh, let's go. Is it live support? No, it's, uh, it's facility. Okay. You got this, boys. You got this. Good. I think this. Beautiful. I hope they can move through here. Or is that a like like an actual block? Like a blocked area. Uh, we will check this out. It doesn't say anything about cannot reach or something, so this should be fine. Double toilet! Yeah, and they were actually going there. Perfect. <laughs> and now they can talk. You know what? They can have a nice conversation while they are sitting on the toilet. Alrighty. Did we trade already? I think we traded already earlier. Yeah, you were the plastic guy. Good! Next jump, guys. Let's go ahead and... Uh... This asteroid seems to be clear. Mm -hmm. I think we have a problem. And that problem is that we have to jump on a hyperlane. And that means we need to get another one of these cryo chambers online. And we are missing an energy block. So, where do we get an energy block from? From here, right? Oh, we can build one. That's fine. So, next cryo chamber is gonna come online. And uh, while we are doing it, we're gonna be preparing a jump. Let's go. It, it really seems like we are going to the next sector. Here we go. Oh, man. I'm excited. I want to see where we are going. Uh, this seems like a dead end to me. So, we're gonna go back here. We have completely stripped all of these things. There's nothing here. Uh, we have been there already, did we? I don't know. Doesn't matter. I want to jump. Gonna jump to the next sector. Um, however, our cryo chamber is not there yet. We gotta build that first. Okay. Deploy here. And then we're gonna build, and then we're gonna jump. And I am hoping that we can find more attack blocks there. I think just getting the derelicts and always getting some attack blocks from the abandoned ships, that's a way to actually get our resources set up. I think I should really, really go for that as a priority. Good. Cryo chamber is online, seemingly. Why is the door not open? I don't know. Is it done? Now it's done. All right. So, prepare to jump, guys. Let's do it. The boldly go where no one has gone before. Everybody is in cryo chambers. Let's do it. This is so cool. I like the layout of my ship. I mean, it's not looking like a like a like the silhouette is not looking like a ship ship. It's more like a cluster of things. But we have everything we need, and we have a compartment for absolutely everything. Okay, everybody still alive? Somebody get, I don't know, bitten by an alien while they were sleeping, huh? No? Good? Fine. That means that we will prepare the next jump directly, because in the first system, after you you come out of your jump, there's nothing in there. And we want to go where we actually can do something. Like, oh, oh, that's a big system. I love it. Like here, you know? Let's drop. Critical resources are always good. Like, we have no problem. And I think as long as we are staying in motion, we will always get the chance to find some more ice blocks, to get some more water, and actually, um, not only get water, but also fuel our little farm. And that farm is producing like crazy. You can see that here. Yeah, that's, that's really, really good. Okay. I'd say... Why is Holden in his spacesuit? Oh, he's doing things. Good. Uh, I'll take Holden, I'll take Alan, I'll take Jebediah and Jean-Luc this time. We're gonna drop these people and we're gonna get into the shuttle to see what we can get out of this... Uh, what is that? A derelict. It seems very blasted. By the way, soon we should be able to find abandoned ships that we can actually... Um, I don't know, claim. You know? 
They are not that damaged and you can actually rebuild them and then you have a second ship. That's a thing that is coming probably quite soon. Oh yeah, and this is the next this is the next alien. Alien eggs. We're getting closer. Shoot them! I mean, luckily they have no range. We can just sit here and, and just blast the whole corridor with the shotguns. This is why I like them. Shotguns are so good. They just shoot so many projectiles at the same time. Ah, no. Get him! Alright. Let's check this out. Ugh. Nasty eggs. Shoot this. Are we done? Oh my god, that's a big one! Um... What? What are you? Oh my god, he had health! Holy crap, this is so infested! Look at that! Oh, it even has different environments! Like all of these, these uh, alien tentacles all over the place. What the... Actual... Hell! Uh, we get some credits here. Oopsie. Destroy something that I didn't want to destroy. I don't dare going into the reactor room here. Let's see. Ah. There's another one of these. He's jumping at us. Uh, not everybody is getting a good line of sight here. This is fine still. Can I pick up here? Anybody got hurt? You got hurt. Extremely fatigued. Major discomfort. Feeling hungry. Monster bite! No! Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Terrified and scared. Wow. Yeah, these guys were giving us hell. Okay. The good news is uh, that we can go... Can we go home? No, we cannot go home. Somebody has to actually pick up Jean-Luc. No, a Jebediah. And, and bring him home safely. Okay, the other guys. Jean-Luc, can I draft you? I want you to pick up the data pad here. And what's Holden doing? Holden, I think you also need to be drafted for the moment. Because if you now enter the spaceship and just run away with it, then... Uh, that's not gonna be good. So everybody's home? Oh, I should still... I should still draft you, right? Okay, I, I wanna see if this... I, I don't wanna do anything bad here. Undraft. Are you going home? Okay, good. Good, good, good. We got this. <laughs> Alrighty, what's in there? Ah, just one tag block. But everything is good. I'll take basically everything. Yeah, that's fine for me. Good. Insufficient resources, energy scrap. That's okay. We're actually running out of energy scrap to recycle, but that is fine for me. Incoming ship next turn as well. What's it gonna be? Hostile? No, friendly. Good. Good, good, good. Maybe they have tech blocks. If so, all of our problems are gonna be solved instantly. Check it out. Why do we only... Oh, we only have one tech block because we built another cryo chamber. And that's right. So, what about Jebediah? You got bitten? It's not festering or anything. No, it goes down. Perfect. And I wonder why Jebediah is just standing here. We have a med bay. He could easily go there and just heal himself. He's down to 75 health, so... Maybe he doesn't consider it being that bad. Okay. Hello, mister. Not what I wanted. I could buy some Energium. Energium. We could build some more energy cells. We have energy cells. We have a lot. Uh, energy rods. It's always good to have some extra energy there. I think. Yeah, I'll do it. Uh, you're gonna get the guns, all of them, and I'm gonna buy like four units or so. 
Uh, you can also have food if you like. We have so much food. Sure. We're gonna give him the meat. Because we can easily reproduce that. Yeah, seems fine to me. Good, good, good. So in terms of resources, we have all of them. We don't need more. What we need is bigger storage, honestly. Uh, weight is fine still. That's good. Tech blocks. You always need tech blocks. Oh, it's kind of my critical resource at all times. I don't know. I've never had a playthrough and I had like three so far. Uh, and uh, two of them died early on. <clears throat> this is the, the one that I played the longest so far. And um, I, it always was tech blocks. Always missing tech blocks. I don't know if that's gonna be different later. As soon as you have your um, your industry set up. But you know what? Let's see. Okay, oxygen levels. I'm just checking my, my values here right now. Oxygen levels are fine. CO2 values. 29, 28... Uh-huh. They are also okay. It's uh, safe. It's all green. We have no smoke. We have no hazardous gases. Sadly, I gotta say. Sadly. Uh, there's another ship coming in. What's that? Oh, it's another friendly ship. Alright, we're gonna check them out as well. Very good. And then we have what? Comfort? Alright. Alright, that's pretty good comfort now in our main stations. Seriously. That is amazing. Yeah, I think the light really kicked it. Uh, we should probably also put a light down here. That makes a lot of sense. And then there is temperature. And it's quite cold up there, I gotta say. Like, really cold. On the bridge as well. So I think I'm gonna put a heater. A pita heater. On... What's that? Life support. Yeah. Put a heater here on the wall. That should heat up this area. Okay, so, we have another ship. Let's go ahead and trade. <sighs> yeah, you're... They, they don't have it. Nobody has tech blocks. Everybody's uh, kind of problematic on that end. But you know what? We're gonna fix that in the next episode of Space Haven. I hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, then don't forget to leave a rating. Subscribe to the channel if you want more of this. And I hope to see you guys next time. Goodbye.